Well, here comes the number, oh, Mike, as we speak. Uh, it's uh, down at $36.5 billion, so the trade ga gap, uh, a much uh, bigger decline. In fact, the trade deficit, though, in U.S. jumping 18% in September to $36.5 billion. So forgive me, the gap actually widening. So, Mike, we were looking for a number of $31.8 billion, but that number coming in much wider than expected, $36.5 billion. Uh, import mm -hmm. price uh, index also coming up 0.7%. Analysts that uh, we surveyed, economists we surveyed, were looking for a rise of 1%. But let's talk about that gap, Mike, because much wider than expected. Yeah, I'm taking a look right now at the numbers, and it looks like uh, exports came in much wider than expected, but imports significantly wider. Imports were up 5.8% on the month, or exports rose 2.9%, so that's why you get your big swing in the trade deficit. The balance falls to, as you mentioned, 36.5 billion dollars from 30.8. So a significant change. Right now, I'm trying to find basically where that came from. At this point, it looks like the ex-petroleum imports rose as well. Uh, so it, we probably have a combination at this point. And, and if you give me a few minutes, I could break that down for you. On the import price level, uh, petroleum prices rose nine tenths of a percent, almost a full percent. So uh, probably oil prices had a lot to do with what we're seeing here.